What's going on guys? Ice Viper 777 here. Uh, I'm playing ZMR, uh, Zombies, Monsters, Robots. Um, it's a little different kind of a game for me to be playing, I guess, but in the uh, meantime, I'm uh, trying to play some other stuff, I guess, just kind of broaden my horizons a little bit, and at the same time, there's really not a lot to play on the old Xbox right now. Um, got the Dragon's Teeth DLC coming soon. Look at this guy. This guy's freaking insane. He's a monster, dude. <clears throat> um, but this game, I don't know, it's interesting. It's in like its beta phase kind of right now, so um, you kind of have to like bear with that being in place. Uh, but yeah, I don't know. We're just in kind of a drought right now. I'm looking forward to the games that are coming this fall, uh, and I'll be uploading more with that but it's just like in the meantime i just don't really know what else to upload so i figured i'd try some different games and just upload footage of me playing that and see what happens um this game it's pretty cool it, it, it kind of reminds me of gears of war i mean you can probably just tell that by looking at the video uh even like the aiming reticles and like the movement i mean you are moving a lot faster than you would in gears like right now i'm just freaking usain bolting through the map um but the map i mean the lighting and everything it just it kind of looks like gears um and some of the gameplay, I mean, I don't know, just, it, you can, you'll can notice it as you're watching it, but I mean, I loved Gears, I sucked at it, I'll be the first to admit it, um, and I'm frankly not that great at this game either, but <laughs> it's something different, I guess, so it keeps it entertaining. Um, my, like, only real gripe, and this is, could just be, like, it's a beta thing, is that it's really hard to tell, like, what killed you or where you died from. You just, like, spontaneously just fall over and, like, oh, you gotta respawn. It's like, uh, okay. But, yeah, like, right here, it's like, wait, what just killed me? <laughs> um, but, otherwise, I mean, it's it's entertaining enough. You've got a variety of weapons and uh, characters to choose from. And, uh, there's, like, a flamethrower that you can use that was pretty sick. I used that. The, uh, like, default rifle you get is pretty, pretty good, I felt. I mean, it was accurate enough you can't really upgrade it or anything though um you have to use other weapons to upgrade which is kind of interesting but um i guess for like a base default weapon it's not bad um definitely a ver like a lot of variety in uh what's going on on the map too i mean you, you can see all the different stuff just kind of like running around like this thing's like a dog or something i don't really know what it is but it's like you've got a variety of things to uh try and kill you and uh, there's a nice little double kill. And then you got these like huge things running around too, which is just insane. And they look like they can really just mess you up pretty good. <laughs> I'm glad this guy was on my side. I was like, oh my god. About to get ran over here. But there, I think I just got like exploded by something. I just, it's hard to tell. But the shotgun's not bad either. If you like uh, shotgun using, I mean, it's it's pretty good for like these close quarters maps. I like the layout of this map too. It's pretty cool. I mean, it's... It's like a good nighttime map. You don't really see that a lot in games. Like, I mean, Battlefield didn't really have a whole lot of, like, solid nighttime maps. You got, like, Tehran Highway, which, some BF3, which that was just kind of garbage. I don't know, but it was an okay map, but um, this is a interesting map. A little different, like, landscape, too, with the kind of, like, temples and stuff. Um, <clears throat> here I am playing as, like, one of those giant-ass mercs or whatever. I'd... I don't know, it doesn't really remind you of Titanfall because it moves too fast, but it's sort of like that. And uh, you just feel like invincible. I wasn't really sure what was happening there, but I was trying to get this guy here and then just something else just killed me and I just don't know what. Um, but all in all, you can check out this game online. Um, it's just, uh, I'll, well, I'll put the link in the description, but it's just called ZMR. Um, just zmr.amassi.com. And you can play it for free. They have the, the beta up for free. Just download it and then create your character. There's a little tutorial tutorial you have to go through. Um, which isn't too bad and it kind of shows you the ropes. Here's the part where I was, okay, well, I was trying to use the flamethrower. Um, this is actually, what is this? What are they using? Oh, this is like the, the mini gun, like the Gatling gun thing. This thing was sick. I forgot about this thing. I played the game a little earlier. I'm just voiceovering it now. Um... There's a lot of, like, stuff to disorient you in this game, but I guess the more you play it, the more you get used to it. Um, but yeah, it's it'd be fun to play with some friends. I mean, if you got a couple friends together and kind of, like, band out together and uh, play, if you want to play sometime, I guess hit me up. Um, 
I don't know how much. I mean, with Dragon's Teeth coming out, I'm probably going to be playing that a lot. I'll try to get some videos for you guys of the Dragon's Teeth action. Um, but yeah, I'd recommend checking it out. At least give it a try. I mean, if you got, if you're like me, you're just kind of like, oh, I, I need something to play. I need something fresh. Then this ought to do it for you. I just got wrecked by that guy. <laughs> he just launched like a giant thing at me. I don't know what the hell that was, but that was pretty crazy. But yeah, all right, guys, take take it easy.